hi and welcome to another instrument choice support video. In this video we'll demonstrate how to measure sushi rice using the Sushi pH kit, the ICPH20. Your pH meter should be calibrated ideally before use, if not at least once per week. The Sushi pH kit comes with everything you need to perform this. If you're unsure of how to calibrate this meter, see the video link in the description. To measure, we'll need water for rinsing. We use deionized water. A rice paste made from 50% acidified rice and 50% water. We use deionized water. And the calibrated meter. Start by turning the device on and removing the clear protective cap. This pH meter has a shield over the electrode to help prevent any damage. Rinse the electrode in deionized water then place into the acidified rice paste sample. Wait for a stable measurement. The recommended pH limit of acidified sushi rice is 4.6 or less. This is to inhibit the growth of pathogenic bacteria. A stable reading is indicated by the smiley face on the screen. We have our pH reading of 5.1, which is a little bit above the ideal range. After use, clean the pH meter with warm water and a mild detergent. Rinse thoroughly. To make cleaning easier, the electrode shield can be removed. Once clean, place a few drops of tap water into the electrode cap, turn the device off and store away for your next pH measurement. We hope that you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.